Napier's bitch, Napier Jerry. Napier running bag. Jerry name so nice, say it twice. <laughs> running name you. so nice, gotta say it huh. twice. Pussy wet, gotta hit it with some rice. Damn, my rap flow super nice, but y'all ain't here to hear me rap. Y'all here for this reaction. So I'm finna give it to you. We back with a screw attack reaction. Shit, what is you that? Feel passion in my voice. Yeah, your bitch said, damn, I'm moist. Boy, if you don't get To it. So it's nap. It, it, I was about to say it's a nappy head reaction. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it is. It is a nappy reaction. It is a nappy head reaction, but it it's a one. screw attack death battle. Nappy head reaction. But who is it between, though? We got my bitch. Chill out, man. We got my bitch. Uh, Black Widow. You get, and you got Eric's bitch. Widowmaker. I'm gonna be honest. Widowmaker way finer than Black Cut. Like Dude, she's purple, man. Sure. That's that exotic and shit. And she's boy. Yeah, this time exotic. Oh, if it ain't born, then it's foreign. Hit, hit that Kodak mm-hmm. black headed. If it ain't born, then it's foreign. And, she's and it's fine, purple. She's purple, though. She's fine. That's and a fine-ass alien. She probably got that ass. You gotta she, go. She got that ass. You too. gotta go. That purple ass yeah. on you. Throw, throw that shit back, shirty. Throw, okay, zoom shirty. In, zoom okay, in. shirty. Zoom in. Nasty bitch. Data on basically everything you want to learn about. And with 23andMe, this includes your own DNA. With over 125 genetic reports, 23andMe can give you insight about your health, race, ancestry, and so much more. Have you been running late in the morning because you're actually like a dumbass? Guess what? It might help to improve your genes. No kidding. I've tried it myself, and it's really easy to mail in your sample in just a few steps. To see what your genes have to say about your health traits and more, buy your health. Now, before we start, you want to switch? 23andMe.com. No, I'm switch. Well, that's on hidden. That switch on your bitch get all nasty as shit. Damn. All right, I'm chill out. What the fuck is a rooster teeth? Why well, name it that? I fuck this. I don't But many are thrust upon these roles with very little regard. And they simply make the best of their new stressful life. Like Black Widow, the covert enemy turned ally of the Avengers. And Widowmaker, the deadly but unwitting Look at Widowmaker. Nice Oprah. ass teeth, boy. He's sweet. And it's our job to analyze the rest of our own skills. Exactly. I like that. Win a death battle. <sighs> Natalia Romanov, more commonly known as the anglicized Natasha Romanov, is one of the more curious members of the legendary Avengers. Yeah, unlike most of them, she doesn't have any ridiculous superpowers, and she even started out as a bad guy. Like many secret agents, Natasha's past is a mystery. One account claims she was raised 91. by Ivan huh? Petrovich, who taught her the art of combat. His teachings were so affluent that Natasha was kidnapped by an order of assassins known as the Hand, intending to train her as their master assassin. Luckily, How was she 91? rescued her, but she eventually put her talents to use working for the KGB and becoming the famous ballerina. However, the most likely story was that Petrovich admitted a young Natasha to a secret Soviet program called the Black Widow Ops. There, in the infamous Red Room, Natasha was trained to be the deadliest spy in the world. She learned all sorts of stealth, assassination, and martial arts techniques, including the newly invented Sambo style, which is basically like street fighting judo mixed with the craziest grappling moves ever. Like, how did she even do that? Uh, Russian's magic. She learned dozens of other martial arts, including karate, Muay Thai, Aikido, and Kung Fu. And she's mastered all sorts of weaponry, becoming an expert marksman. Damn, sign me up for the spider up. Don't get the wrong idea. The Red Room was brutal. Natasha was brainwashed, literally programmed with false memories, which included her days as a ballerina. She was even forced to duel other members to the death. Crazy to think about considering how much went into each one's training, but all the more to transform her into the ultimate stone cold spy, codenamed Black Widow. Yeah, sometimes that's what you gotta do if you wanna be a winner. When I was a kid, Mama Boomstick trained me and some friends to eat over 60 hot dogs in 10 minutes. I was the only one who survived. That's. wow. You should Still a suspect, but okay. Well, while Natasha was plenty deadly on her own, she got one more gift from the Red Room. A super soldier serum. Because at the time, oh. everyone and their dog was trying to make the next Captain America. But she wound up 
with the knockoff dollar store version because the Nazis decided to kill the only person in the world who knew how to make it. Seriously, what was this guy thinking? Even still, she received some impressive benefits, including a beyond Olympic level physique, inhuman resistance to poison and disease, and slowed aging. So she gets to keep her good looks for over a century and run up to 35 miles an hour. Yeah, that's, that's crazy. Good too. As the Black Widow, she keeps up a spider room. That's crazy. That is years. crazy. Soon becoming the KGB's top operative, taking on the most perilous of missions. She wasn't wrong until she found herself face to face with an adversary who proved her Okay, magic. I'm still trying to go Iron crazy in Granny Pussy, boy. Hey, with enough munition to wipe out a whole city to stop you, you know you're pretty good at what you do. To destroy Iron Man and his team of Avengers, Black Widow recruited Hawkeye and attempted to sway him to the dark side. But to her surprise, the exact opposite happened. Yeah, turns out Hawkeye is so goddamn handsome that he literally love struck the brainwashing out of her. And so Black Widow betrayed her country and became an ally of the Avengers. And while keeping up with the likes of Iron Man and Thor is no easy feat, she held her own not just with her amazing talents, but also her plethora of gear and gadgets. Where does she keep all that body suit? It's like super I'm missing the girl that girl. Thank you. Thank you. I've been sleeping on. Well, not only is her suit composed of an abnormally durable Kevlar, she has Dude, she turned down that ass. She got fired. Okay. Yeah, I see around. Cartridges of tear gas pellets and explosives serve obvious purposes. And then there's the widow's bite. What? Spider bite? How is that supposed to work? Huh? Wow. That was pretty shocking, Liz. Even without the KGB, Black Widow remains one of the top assassins in the world. She's so skilled with a sniper rifle, she could cut Hawkeye's bowstring while he's in mid-shot, forcing him to miss his target. To put this in perspective, the average thickness of compound bowstring is about one hundredth of an inch thick. Damn, That's as thin as a fingernail. Damn. And made the shot from hundreds of feet away. She's quick enough to easily... Yeah, to check this in. That's a fingernail to be like 100 men by herself. Pretty impressive. That's 600 pounds of force to break the human neck. Spider so Mercy. So goddamn tough. She's taking a grenade to the face from a few feet away, and she was fine. She Spider fell Mercy. four stories, threw a mounted sight into a car, and she was fine. So much for that super serum being dollar store just great. Well, can she take these back shots? Damn, she she beat Wolverine? Wolverine? But she ain't beat me, though. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just no matter what. Yeah, like the time when she had to go through intensive surgery while she was still conscious. Just imagine. She felt every cut again, huh? every movement as the surgeon you know? sliced over you know? her stomach and sewed up her inside. Despite the incredible pain throughout this entire ordeal, which likely lasted several hours, for her own sake, she could not move a muscle. But even alongside the Avengers, Natasha maintains a great sense of morality. Her path to redemption has been a rocky one, as her personal quest to destroy the Red Room has left a trail of bodies in its wake. This is one redhead you don't want to mess with. Mm, I would like to take my chances. Good boy. While the stories of many world-class assassins often carry a truckload of baggage, few are quite as heartbreaking as the case of Amelie Lacroix. That's even more true than you think, but we'll get there. Growing up, Amelie never aspired or trained for combat. In fact, she devoted much of her life to becoming a world-renowned ballerina in Paris, France. You know, I've noticed it's almost a requirement for all badass assassins to be ballerinas or something. So uh, I started working on a few moves. What? Wait, hold on. Ah. Amelie's husband, however, was a key figure for Overwatch, a global peacekeeping organization spearheading operations against a terrorist group called Talon. Talon tried over and over to kill this guy, but they just couldn't pull it off. So instead, they kidnapped Amelie. Damn. Not cool. Thankfully, Overwatch quickly rescued her, and life returned to normal. Or did it? Nope. Because out of nowhere, Amelie killed her hubby in its sleep. Turns out the 
kidnapping wasn't just a simple ransom or attempted lure. Talon ruthlessly subjected Amelie to intense neurological reconditioning, molding her into the perfect brainwashed sleeper agent. Right, because she was sleeping next to him in their bed and then bam, hey, look at all that she got, bro. Sleeper agent. Uh, look, right, sir. Thing. She returned to Talon to complete their psychological and physiological reconfiguration process. When all was said and done, Amelie Lacroix was no more. In her place stood the cold-hearted assassin known as Widowmaker. Ah, I get why she's called Widowmaker. She so it is kind of weird that the widow she was making was her. Really <laughs> do this Widowmaker I'm tired of wolves sticking down. So well, it's actually literal. Talon's experiment slowly oh, surprised and suppressed her emotions, oh, turning her into an actual cold-blooded killing machine. Hence, the cold blue skin. That's not really a thing, is it? Turning your skin blue like that? Oh, I just figured she was the girl smart ball grown up. Gotta be some trauma. There's actually a pretty easy way to turn your skin blue. You just need to drink some colloidal silver. Uh, is it safe? Oh, yeah, sure, no doubt. It's 100% non-toxic silver. Okay, bottoms up. Diamond, diamond, yes. <laughs> anyway, the blue makeover wasn't just for show. With her heart rate down, her body's movements and vibrations are highly reduced. The blood pulsing through your hands can actually bump up your shot. It's not by luck, but when you're aiming at something a thousand yards away, even a tiny bit of movement matters. This might not sound too difficult, until you consider that a typical human heart rate in a stressful situation can exceed 100 beats per minute. A perfect sniper has to time their shots between almost two beats per second. So even though she started pretty late, Widowmaker skipped years of killing people's school with just this one little tweak. Talon's manifesto is that humanity is made stronger through conflict. And so Widowmaker was taught a variety of different combat and covert techniques to be ready for any violent possibilities. She's ridiculously athletic. Just look at her go. And she's got plenty of handy tools to help her kill people even faster. She carries a grappling hook with a 65-foot cable. Perfect for getting around any terrain in an instant. Her venom mines stick to most surfaces, and after being triggered by movement, release a deadly toxin. And give her opinion, her funny-looking spider helmet. That's Widowmaker's recon visor. Basically, multi-screen super goggles. They provide infrared sight that spots heat signatures through walls and transmits multiple feet. Then there's her signature weapon, the one, the only, Widow's Kiss. It may look like an oversized SMG, but with a click of a button, it turns into a badass sniper rifle. What did these niggas just say? Four different levels of power. A fully charged shot hits ten times stronger than a standard one, making okay. the widow's kiss one of the deadliest rifles in the world. Unless you're wearing some really heavy armor, it'll kill pretty much anyone with just one shot. Wiz, fails to be one now. Yeah, with your luck, your hand will probably get stuck in one of the moving parts, and I'll have to be the one to amputate it and build you a mechanical replacement. Yeah, I'm in. You don't know that. Stupid whiz. Widowmaker is one of Talon's top agents and has the beats to prove it. She's taken on Overwatch members multiple times, effortlessly defeating some of their own top agents, like fellow sniper Anna Amari, whose cybernetic eye can see six times greater than a normal one. And she pulls this off while achieving ulterior goals, such as when she baited Tracer into unknowingly allowing her to assassinate a diplomat. That's some intense on the fly multitasking. And she's way tougher than she looks. Her visor can protect her from a sniper shot to the face. And she even took a hit from Doomfist's gauntlet. This thing can take down a skyscraper. But she was fine. While it wasn't wielded by Doomfist himself at the time, it clearly struck with some serious power. An average skyscraper ranges between 250 to 300 feet tall. Oh, to mercy. it in one go, you need a force equivalent to at least two tons of TNT. You sure Talon didn't slip her some super serum and a drink or anything? Cause that's ridiculous. Also, while ranged combat may be her forte, Widowmaker is skilled enough to take out an entire armed security force up close while avoiding their gunfire. You can take me out too, she can do it all. Kinda sucks that Talon drained her of all emotion, cause now she can't appreciate how badass she is. Kinda like how I sometimes forget I have a shotgun for a leg. Until it's... Ah, damn. God, I hate when that happens. Talon's experiments may have yielded astounding results, mm. but I'm not sure they were quite so thorough. In fact, every Christmas, a certain blue-skinned woman can be found leaving a rose at her late husband's grave. So maybe, just maybe, 
Amelie isn't quite gone for good. A single death can change everything. Oh yeah, sorry, the accent. All Bitch, right, take me. Just take me. Take. But first, I'm yours. The internet should be complicated beef. Just think about how often we use public online networks like in hotels, restaurants, airports. Or when I borrow my neighbor's wife because they never set up the password. Or those Tough. of us who want to protect our privacy, this can be disastrous. Tough. But if you really want to use a VPN, use Bear's Tunnel. But no, fuck that. You use you know, use Express VPN. Those guys are good too. I like I like, I like Bear's Tunnel. But what I use is Express VPN. Uses their digital magic to encrypt your internet data, shielding it from anybody who's trying to dig their way in. And as the name implies, Express VPN is consistently faster than. <laughs> All right, you guys, if you like this uh, reaction so far, subscribe, like, comment, subscribe, hit turn on bell notifications, turn it on, like scroll down right quick, turn on bell notifications, while you're there, subscribe too, hit us with a like, because we appreciate you. Yeah, bro, you. scroll down, bro, scroll down like the video. Scroll down, alright, let's get straight to it though. Appreciate it. User. Yes, all right. Who's on Twitch start? Ooh, yes, please. Oh, shit, shut the fuck on that boy. Sheesh. Ooh. Damn. Oh, she's a better shot than she is. That's good. Yeah. I think I think uh, Black Widow might just take the W with her endurance. Though, I'm gonna be honest with you. But we'll see. But she's immune. She's immune. She's just fucking with you. Exactly. Black Widow, she's not saying Black Widow with a hand to hand combat, but we'll see. Oh no, maybe I'm wrong. <coughs> yeah, I'm not wrong. Yeah, you got. You, I don't know. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Damn. Sheesh.
I low key called it. Nah, I won. No, 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 I know. I low key called that she was gonna go fast, though. So.